leave your luggage, we'll have to go up, you know, overhead there. Yeah, so no, take off and land. Um, Mama, it's good. Fine. After a delay of five and a half hours, we're finally on this damn flight. And we have the flights like six and a half, seven hours. I'm so tired, so over it. I just checked into my hotel and the shower. The shower head above the parapet and so that at least face to face with more of the guests this morning I can introduce myself and introduce the tour everyone and give a bit more of a sort of warm personal welcome. They'll come downstairs to you downstairs as well. I don't want you to feel neglected and unloved. And uh, to welcome everyone to our tour to Stonehenge and Bath which really rocked you know. I like to think our tour to Stonehenge and Bath really, really does rock. And I'm I'm not I'm not just being complacent or big headed, everyone. Perhaps I should be a little bit more specific. It's uh, um it's all about rocks, those ancient rocks or stones going back to prehistoric times, which were arranged in some kind of mysterious symbolic ritual fashion at Stonehenge. Uh, um, UNESCO World Heritage Site going back around 5,000 years and that's going to form the first site uh, that we're going to visit today and then we're traveling on everyone to the town of Bath all built up in one consistent lovely honey colored hued rock uh, a golden color and dubbed the golden city um, and one of the best preserved neo georgian and classical towns in the whole country, built by the Romans initially, or founded by them, nearly 2,000 years ago, and on the basis of the only naturally rising thermal springs in all of the UK.
guys. We're at Stonehenge. It's so cool. And the countryside is so beautiful. Be further than that end though, wouldn't it? So at this hot spring you can drink, you can taste the water, so I want to taste it. Mom, Mom do you want to taste the water? Is that good for you? Let's taste it. Divine. How bad can it be? Not good. It has a taste for sure. It has a taste, like minerally. It tastes cloudy. Does that make sense? It tastes cloudy because it's warm, I guess. So, due to some um, unforeseen circumstances, we had to stop at the side of the road. It's 10:15 p.m. My phone's on 6% and we are waiting to leave again. So we had gas station food for dinner and we're here. Really living large over here, babe. She's not fresh, but the flavors are there. I'm so tired, I can't wait to take a hot shower and go to bed. We'll probably reach home until like midnight or after, I don't know right now. Good morning. We're going to Harrods today. We're going to go to the Prada Cafe. This is my outfit. It's like a 
two-piece set with the hair. Um, and we're gonna go to a few places. Ecuador, yeah? Yep. Ecuador. I um need my Oh it's hard. It has like a shell. Oh wow. Oh I think it's fondant. That's why it was so shiny. You've been to Harrods and you had a time. Alright guys, we made it to the famous London Bridge. But it's not the London Bridge. It's the Tower Bridge. <coughs> shirt that I've worn maybe twice before and I have my Gucci heels on um, it's like a black heel so uh, we're walking to the restaurant it's like 10 minutes away jewelry a little bit more jewelry than I had on ring these earrings are um, from Swarovski they were a gift and a red lip, a little bit of makeup, and you know my style purse I take everywhere. We're going to an Indian place, like a modern Indian. I've heard the Indian food in London is amazing, so let's go. Cheers. My hands are not focusing. Salud. Happy 50th birthday, mom. You're the best mom I could have asked for. White people, bring us the naan. Naan, korma. That's a good salad plunger. It tastes like a snow bar. Oh, gotta get the... Gotta get the video ready, babe. I used to go to Buddy's at like 14, drink a beer, and... Yeah, it's very hard not to get a guest company to do. Like, when I first started my career, it was easier, but now it's like the lottery and the investment. Yes. Yeah, I think I was one of the lucky ones too when I first as soon as I bought it was the It's the sorbet. Yeah, but check out the video. Yeah. Yeah. Um, so all you have to do is ask. Thank you. Okay. 
Wow, look at the painting. Guys, we came for lunch at the Ivy in Victoria and it's so beautiful and I don't know why I'm out of focus. Excuse me. Wow. Look at it. Wow, it's so pretty, mom. I want these paintings in my house because I love butterflies. Hi, I'm back. So, we went to the Ivy, we had lunch, super beautiful, and we left quickly because we're going to the Carol J concert at the O2 Arena. Super excited. This is what I'm wearing. This um, sequence top that I've worn multiple times. It's backless and just jeans and sneakers. But I have this new bag I wanna wear. TJ Maxx, maybe $25. And we're taking the train to the O2 because I feel like that's the easiest thing to do. the arena. Only small bags less than a full size are allowed inside the arena. Alright guys, we're in our suites. And we're the only people here. It's my mom. Carol will be right there. Oh yes! I know, but this is like nicer. Patty. 
Look at this cute book wall. And look at this living room. Will it even focus? It's pretty. And it's already 6 p.m. so I'm making a coffee. And I've never made coffee with this, um, I think it's called a mocha pot. So I'm going to drink some coffee and get myself together because I look insane. I'm going to go to dinner. I just made a reservation for Libertino. It's like Italian with a French beer. I'm gonna have this coffee with, I don't know what this is, and a madeleine and get ready for dinner. I'm back in my apartment in Paris, but girl, after the meal I just had, I can barely breathe, like, I ate so much pasta, I ate pizza, I ate bread, I ate dessert, and I had a cocktail. I feel like eight months pregnant. What do you mean? In, in the closet thing? Mm -mm. That's disappointing. Just got some brushes and makeup. There's no blow dryer in the apartment. Oh. I have to wash my hair tomorrow. took the train out of Paris and we are at Versailles. That's what I'm wearing. And it's so beautiful. We we're just walking up to it and it's so it looks insane. It looks insane. Guys, you can't tell how like bright the gold is. It's so shiny. <laughs> to think that people lived here is unreal. Ready now. Uh, a box of six, please. Uh, the green. Thank you. May I also have the a juice? The yes, the raspberry. Merci. I feel like I haven't properly updated you guys. We finished our first eye, ran home like crazy people to get ready to go to the Eiffel Tower to take pictures, and we had to make it in time for it to sparkle because it sparkles on the top of every hour. We made it, and now we're smoking hookah. 
you know when you're a little hook, sticking up her? <laughs> and we're drinking some tea. So, Good morning everyone, happy Friday from Paris. Um, we got home last night and we actually made some pasta before we went to bed. And now we're having breakfast but it's, it's 2.23 in the afternoon and we're now having breakfast. We got, um, we're at this toast place, so we got like a two savory toast and french toast. And then, we're going to the loop. Yes, we're going to the loop. basement of the Louvre. Um, it's not as busy here. Barely saw the Mona Lisa, but it's okay. Um, and we're gonna go have an early dinner. It's probably like 6 p.m. now. Walk back to our apartment. And it's 5.44, walk back to our apartment. And we're going to Moulin Rouge tonight, but till 11. So we have a moment to like, chill out. So I realized I didn't film anything last night because you guys don't even know what happened. We went to Milan Rouge, which was beautiful. The costumes, amazing, beautiful, lovely. Then, well, before that, we took a cab, which was a mistake, because we were stuck in traffic for like 25 minutes in a crowd, in like a mob-like crowd. They were shaking our car, it was scary. I'll put a clip here. But we made it to Milan Rouge eventually, and I was just not in the mood to film, but that was beautiful. And then I walked home 30 minutes in my heels through crowds to get home but today is our last day in Paris and I just got dressed and went to a bakery to get some pastries look at this that's a quiche with cheese well two croffin croissant and I am so excited I haven't had a croissant in France as yet. I had um, pain au chocolat, which is a chocolate croissant, but it's not the same, you know? So I'm gonna pack, because i that's my mess on the floor. I'm gonna eat this croissant, pack. We actually did some laundry, surprisingly. And we're gonna go to this rooftop place to have one final dinner, and it has a view of the entire of Paris. So I'm excited for that. My underarm looks dark. Goodbye. First, the croissant. I made half of the croissant and half of the croffin. Ooh. Mm. Look at the croffin. A cross between a croissant and a muffin and this chocolate filled. I want to break this apart. It's so pretty. Look 
little layers. Tell me why. I try to go to this rooftop bar place. And we get there and it's closed. It was like, but like I fully had a reservation. It's closed. And then my mom really wanted French onion soup, so I've been looking for the fucking French onion soup and I can't find it. Everywhere is either closed, too crowded. We came to this place, they said they ran out. I just. Anyway. I'm about to eat some snails. It's gonna be great. But I have your soup.